Police are looking for the person who attacked a grandmother. CBS News' Joy Benedict is live in Koreatown. She's on Olympic at Vermont, right where that happened. The question, Joy, is why? Yeah, and that's what we don't know, and probably one of the reasons why this is such an infuriating story. I mean, you don't have to know this woman. You don't have to live in this community to be angered to know that an 85-year-old woman was knocked to the ground and injured. And it happened right over here on the street behind me. We're told it was on Olympic right in front of this grocery store when this woman, this grandmother, was simply walking when someone came up from behind her, knocked her to the ground. I want to show you a photo that her granddaughter posted on Facebook, but I'm warning you, it is very disturbing. Just looking at her face with the bruises and the injuries because of this attack. Now, police tell us this all happened Saturday afternoon at around 2 o'clock. They do not believe that she knew her attacker, that this was just some random person who came up from behind her, knocked her to the ground. They don't think he used an object, that he just used his hand, but the force of that impact forced her to lose her balance and fall to the ground and then slam her face there on the pavement, which is what caused those injuries in that very disturbing photo that we just showed you. So, of course, her granddaughter wanted to make everyone aware of this situation for a couple of reasons. She's hoping, and so are police, that there are some witnesses that were out here at around 2 o'clock in the afternoon on Saturday. And she also wanted to make sure that the public was aware of this attack. Because, of course, the biggest fear is if this man can do this to her grandmother, he can do it to your grandmother. So it is very important to police and this woman's family that this person is caught. And they are simply asking for the community's help and assistance in locating this man if anyone saw anything. Guys.